Hey guys, we are back today with another haul video. Our last haul video went down really well and got quite a lot of views. So we've decided to do another one because at the moment we are on our Easter holidays um, and we got so much chocolate and I'm like fed up with chocolate right now. But um, every day since I'm supposed to be studying but I'm going out shopping every day nearly. <laughs> Um, and I brought uh, my little sister along with me. So we're just going to share a couple of products that we bought um, with you guys and share our opinions on them. Um, I haven't actually used very, I haven't, actually yeah, I haven't used anything that I bought yet. Um, but we're just going to get straight into it. The first candy that I went to was NYX and I picked up four, four products from NYX. Um, so I'm going to start off with the two things that I'm obsessed with. These are the NYX Butter Glosses and I'm kind of obsessed with these. I feel like I need to get everyone in the collection. Um, so I got Maple Blondie which is a really nice like peachy like spring coral colour. It just looks so nice. And I also got this creme brulee because I feel like you can put this over any um, lipstick. Um, I love pairing this up with Velvet Teddy from MAC. Um, just to, because um, obviously Velvet Teddy is a matte um, MAC lipstick. There is a tongue twister. Uh, it's a matte MAC lipstick. So um, you put this over, it just makes it look like really nice and shiny and not matte anymore. So I got those. Um, and then I also got this. And I have seen so many people rave about this either on YouTube or Instagram posts. And um, this is the NYX HD Photogenic Concealer. Where you go? And I got this shade in, I think I think this is the shade. It's CW07 Tan Slash Bronze. And I got this and it's kind of like the same colour as my foundation because I don't really like getting the light. You know, people get like real light foundation concealers. Yeah. And um, okay, we filmed this video twice and she's getting fed up with me saying this. But you know the way people get really um like concealers? Yeah, I, that's just not me. I don't it's really... It's like white blotch. Yeah, I don't really like that whole concealer thing on me. It looks amazing on people that do spend time with it. But I just get the concealer that matches my skin tone to be honest. Um, I do go quite dark for my foundation so... Um, yeah, I think this is kind of a dark concealer, but anyways, so I got that, and I think this was, I think, 10, which is quite good, um, a lot of people, um, say it's very, like, the NARS cream concealer, and then last, um, my NYX, um, I got this blush in de desert, desert, or dessert, desert rose, I'm just gonna say, I think it's desert, um, and it's just, like, a really, it's kind of, like, a darker pink, um, red undertones, um, and brown, and it has a, quite a lot of shimmer in it. <laughs> Desert, yeah. It's yeah, it's desert. <laughs> it's desert. Um, so I just cannot wait to use it. I haven't yet used any of the products yet, and um, because I wanted to share them with you guys. Um, so yeah, it's just really, really nice. Um, yeah, it doesn't smell though, like mac. Next is a skincare kind of thing. It's the Simple Kind Eyes Revitalizing Eye Roll. And this is my second, um, I suppose, like bottle of this. This is um, an amazing dupe for the Benefit Puff Off. Um, I was actually only showing Imogen yesterday. Um, I picked, I went into my benefit counter the other day and I picked up the magazine to see the prices of the products and the stuff. And the benefit pop off, pop off, pop off is thirty like thirty euro and ninety something cent or something, which is a bit crazy to be honest. You know, I wouldn't mind paying it on actually makeup, but for something that just has a bit of a metal and a bit of cream, that's I think kind of ridiculous. Um, and they're fine if you know it was a really good product, but you know, it only kind of has a metal ball and like some gel in it. So, um, this is basically it. And um, I love using this in the morning because I do have really bad hay fever and allergies. So, basically, it's just like a metal um, ball, yeah. <laughs> and you can squeeze it, and there's obviously gel the whole way in the tube. And it's so nice and it's so cool into your eyes as well. Um, and I think this is only say six or seven euros, it's quite good. <laughs> Um, it's really good and I love this. So this is my second um, kind of item of this. So it's really, really good. And then another second product that I'm going to show you, which I have had before, but I lost it. This is the, um came in kind of a, it was like um, a kind of triangle kind of packaging. Oh, yeah. And it is the Maybelline New York um, gel eyeliner. And I got mine in brown last time I got, I think in black. Or it could have been brown, but I lost it anyways. Or it's like dark. Oh, whoa. Dark um, and then dropped it. I, it. I think it was brown, but I must have lost it or misplaced it. So I got a new one because um, I saw on Instagram the other day someone had it. I remember, and I was kind of saying to myself, I remember I had that and it was really good. So I, I have used a bit um, of what they say last week and I used a bit yesterday. Well, that wasn't all from yesterday. You know, I used it in a space of time. Um, so it's just a really nice brown. 
it has really tiny bits of shimmer in it and it comes with a brush as well but i must say the brush is like really bad it's not really good at all um i love to use my mac eyeliner brush or my real technique one so that is that um so that is another product that it's my second time buying because it's so good um it's not really like slidey either it's not going to mess up your whole eye and it's actually quite easy to take it off it's not one of those things that stay on and just don't come off and then you hate them forever it's not one of those ones <laughs> which is really good i repurchased the benefit there real i i was so lost with it. i haven't actually worn mascara and i'm not wearing it today either because there's some type of like heat wave here in ireland well i couldn't say heat wave but it has reached say 19 degrees and like you know, people are going out in shorts and string tops and they think, whoa, but I'm still here in a jacket because I am inside and my kind of room is in the shade kind of thing. Sorry. Um, so I repurchased this and this is the Benefit They're Real. They have come out with a new one recently, which is the Benefit Roller Lash. Um, I was <coughs> going to buy that the other day, but um, I was kind of hesitating about it. But then I purchased this one. Um, I will probably purchase that in time, but um, I was going to get lash extensions and... <coughs> um, please stop coughing um she actually doesn't have a cough it's just yeah she just coughs because she's bored probably of me speaking and um, so i was going to repurchase the um this and i said yes i am because i was going to get the la lash extensions when i was going to get the roller lash and now i'm not making sense so i'm going to shut it up because you're getting bored but yeah i just got another one of these they're amazing and um, kind of hard to remove though i would not pay the money for the remover but the micellar garnier water is amazing so here is my first product it is the sally hansen gen Cloth crush zeros in the shade 06 razzler dazzler it is really nice if you pair it up okay. with the pink with the pink nail polish and it's so sparkly it's so nice so yeah and then i also have the essence glossy lip balm berry cupcake and it's a really nice shade of pink with some sparkles added in so the most yeah you can see the sparkles it's really nice so yeah that's all my products oh is that all oh so that is everything guys um i really hope you enjoyed the video if you did remember to give it a really really big thumbs up and um, because um and we'll know whether you like the video or not so um and remember to subscribe if you haven't because um as i said i am on my easter holidays and i will be uploading a lot more than i used to um because when i'm in school i'm always doing homework and study and just things like that that take over my life so um until next time guys bye, bye.